travelers, welcome to Barcelona. If you're coming to the city for the first time or not, there are things that you would probably do that you shouldn't do in order to save money or just to do things properly as a local would do. So follow my advice. Don't do this, do something else instead. Like subscribing to my channel, this is something that you have to do. Let's go. Okay, wait, let's stop here. Do not eat here in Paseis de Gracia or in Ramblas, which is just a few meters away. These two streets, they are super charming. I think you're gonna feel like stopping here, sitting down, having a glass of wine, but you're gonna pay twice or three times the price that you could pay if you go somewhere else. Somewhere else in the nearby, actually. So is it worth it? Well, up to you, up to your budget, but you can have lunch or dinner or drinks in the nearby, in a local place. So what you can do, you can download my Barcelona travel guide app and you can check by neighborhood where to eat, where to have a drink in a local place. Don't do that, do this. Okay, okay, I've got it, I've got it. In Barcelona, most good restaurants work by reservation, so do not show up without having made one. Once you know where to eat, I recommend you to call them and make a reservation. Sometimes they will say, we don't take reservations, you just have to show up. If this is the case, then go early. If not, book a slot. If you're hungry in Barcelona and you just want to eat something, skip these places with pictures, they are not good definitely not good. Try my Barcelona guide app. I made myself with lots of great local restaurants by neighborhood, so it's pretty easy. You don't have to go look for them. I already did that job. Do not queue in Barcelona. You don't have to do that. You don't need to do this. You can buy all the tickets online, but do not buy them in random websites. Look for the official sites. If not, there may be a scam, so make sure you buy the tickets at the official sites or at my website. Do not come to Barcelona by car. This is the worst decision you can ever make. Why? Because there's a lot of traffic jam, there are no free parkings, you cannot access to the old city, so instead take public transportation, it works perfectly. What do tourists do when they come to Barcelona? Of course, they want to go on the touristic bus tour. Well guys, don't do that. Instead, explore the city and take the public transportation that works perfectly. Actually, if you're coming to Barcelona for just one day or two, you're gonna spend the whole day on the bus. This is like going on a car. It goes slowly and there's a lot of traffic jam. So you won't be able to get off or if you get off, you're gonna miss a lot of things on the bus. <laughs> So my suggestion is that you come for more days, three, four, five days, so that you can have an idea of whole Barcelona on the bus, see what the city looks like, and then have time to explore the city as a local. Understood? Do not go to Parkwell by metro, because after this, it's a hilly road, and you're gonna be super tired by the time you get there. <laughs> So the best thing you can do, it is so much better if you can take the public transportation, the bus number 24 or the V19, it will stop you right at the main door. And there are more tips for your visit to Parkwell, watch my video about it. Do not walk around in Barcelona without paying attention to your belongings. Especially in public transportation and in crowded places such as attractions, monuments, etc. So make sure you leave your passport in the hotel, you don't need it actually. And then the rest put it in a bag, right in the front. Do not use your back pockets, do not use even your front pockets. And if you're using a tripod with a camera to take a selfie, mm, I couldn't do it. No, 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 no. If you still want to do it, just look around. Anyone is looking at you and go ahead and good luck. Do not take taxis from the street. You may be a scum. 
It's not that every taxi driver is a scammer, but you may be a scam. If you want to avoid the scams, just download these four applications, Bolt, Cabify, Uber and Freenow, and have a safe trip. Don't go everywhere by taxi. Here in Barcelona, you don't need to. If you are afraid of getting lost, the metro system is super simple. And even the bus, you have these screens where you can see what the next stop is. You can easily help yourself with Google Maps. This is so much cheaper. Don't do this, do that instead. Check, check, and check. you come to El Prat Airport, not Girona or Reus, because these two are super far away, like two hours by car. So unless you get a super deal, take in consideration how much you're gonna spend to get from Girona or from Reus to Barcelona city center. If you want to know how to get from Barcelona city center to Barcelona El Prat Airport, watch my video here. This is a very good choice if you don't want to spend so much money on taxi or you can get here to the city center with this bus which is only six euros and then you take a taxi to your hotel this is so much cheaper okay got it do not come to barcelona without internet in your phone you're gonna need whatsapp with a text and you're gonna need google maps if not you're going to get lost in this tiny street how are you going to make it without internet so i'm thinking Tour the Explorer. If you come to Barcelona, do not book your hotel over there in Raval neighborhood unless you do it in this tiny street right next to Ramblas or over there next to Plaza Universitat, Plaza Universitat or Plaza Catalunya because in the Raval at night it's not very safe. During the day there are a lot of things to do. It is really beautiful. I have already made a video about it. Check it out. So remember at night don't go there this is Rabal this is Gothic instead in case you need a hotel nearby or over there a Champla do not to use the bus if you have a dog unless you take a carrier with you if not just use the metro but make sure your dog wears a muzzle and a leash If you want to go on a day trip from Barcelona, do not go to Andorra. There's even this excursion that says three countries in one day, Spain, Andorra and France. Oh my gosh, don't do that. You won't get to see anything in one day. There are many amazing day trips that you can go instead, like Tarragona, Sitges, Montserrat, Girona and many medieval villages. They definitely make more sense than going to Andorra. I'll keep that in mind. Do not drink in the streets of Barcelona, the fines are high. Instead, come to a bar, download my Barcelona travel guide app and enjoy the best lovely places picked by me, a local in Barcelona. Drink a lot, travelers, do not make noise. And of course, subscribe to my channel. Hope you have enjoyed my video regarding all the things you shouldn't do if you are in Barcelona. And see you next week, travelers. Bye-bye.